My favorite part about wood ducks, their um, green head. I just find it so pr pretty and beautiful. You know what can happen when you give an 11 year old boy with a passion for birds the yeah. keys to the workshop? Doing your motion uh, to approve the wood duck boxes at Heron Park passes unanimously. Worcester County 4 H member Ewan Betts gets his idea approved by the mayor and town council. Did everyone get a chance to read this document? that is up right now on the screen. The place boxes for wood ducks at Heron Park in Berlin, Maryland. And this is Heron Park where the duck boxes will be installed. Ewan, along with his grandfather and his dad, have made several bird boxes to go to family and friends. This is the first time they'll be placed in a public park. Hi, hello, hold your gun up. Yeah, so this is what a bluebird box looks like. And it's around like, two times bigger than this, maybe three. He's working with a bird expert and believes more wood ducks will be attracted to the park once they spot these cozy cedar boxes. Have you done some studying on what they like, the type of habitat they like? They like it, the box near water. Like, like it needs to be on the edge, like this far away from the water probably. And that's gonna be a little bit hard to mount the boxes there. And they like to be at the very edge of the water so when the babies come out, the babies can go straight into the water. He is making it easier for the ducks than video he pointed us to online where ducklings are taking their first splash from 30 feet in the air. The seed of it is like his passion for helping these birds. The seed of it is not like like benefiting himself, you know, and it's really, it's really, it's really cool. The town thinks there could be an economic benefit as well. If we could encourage people to visit one aspect of the town for whatever reason, other aspects of the town benefits, the shops, people visit the shops, the restaurants, uh, people will tell others about it and encourage them to come. <laughs> Ewan and his family got the material and they're donating their time. He says the boxes will last about 25 years. You guys plan on cleaning this annually, your 4-H crew? Yeah, we, I will I will all commit to doing that, yeah, cleaning it. it. Really, to me, the lesson has been uh, like the present moment. You know, it's it's a grounding, it's a grounding thing with birds. And uh, instead of like my mind going ahead or back it's just look at it, the lesson to me is like looking at what's around me right now and you know appreciating how rad it is you put your mind to it you can do it you can do anything really anything you want you can do doesn't matter if it's making boxes or doing something like that you can do anything the you and bets boxes are expected to be installed in march for chesapeake bay media's bay bulletin i'm cheryl costello